Hey everybody, Robert Ibotta here. Hope everybody's having a great day. Today we're going to be playing Hogwarts Legacy and I'm going to be doing a review, walkthrough, playthrough and checking the game out and see how it is. So let's go ahead and dive in. All right. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. You're a wizard, Harry. The term begins on the 1st of September. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. However, due to your unique your, Due to your unique circumstances, the ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Eleazar Fig to help you hone your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. All right, let's let's go ahead and start it. Yo, what's up? What's up, Brody? What's up, everybody? All right, let's see here. I'm gonna pick one of these defaults. What's up, New Jersey? Wizard Rob. <laughs> You're a wizard, Robert. Let's see. Hmm. I don't like really like to mess with this stuff too much. Yo, Glitch, thanks for the follow. Hmm. Let's see, eye color. Make that dark. We'll give my guy some glasses, you know? Mr. Beast. Yeah, I think this one, this one's closer. Freckles. No freckles, complexion. I don't know. There you go. That'll do. Voice one. Let's hear what that voice sounds like. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really <laughs> going to enjoy this class. I don't think that's my voice. That was quite something. Name my character. Let's see what other what other voice tones does he got. Just... I meet a few cobwebs and some dust. Now, I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. 
I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. It was wonderful. I believe I'm... I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. All right, let's go ahead and start this bad boy. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Oh! <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my What's good? What's good? Yo, thanks for the likes. Not you're finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. No, after Ages you. Since I've been to the castle, would be good to see the old pile of rocks. What the heck? Where's the horses at? Guess her. Oh, it's like Santa's sleigh, bro. Yeah. I'll be checking it out. I'm also I'm also recording, so we got the graphics cranked up all the way. It's gonna look fire. Yo, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, Julius? Jonathan, thanks for the follow. Oh, thanks for the gifts. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of it. I have not thought of the house that I want to be in late. yet. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional What's teacher, up, Frogro? First he's time, dude. Remarkably intuitive First time and running it. Gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. Gotta be a villain. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife. Thanks, man. I appreciate it, dude. It's gonna play, it's gonna play different it games, man. Months ago. Miriam? How? She wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly. What's in there? To keep it safe, I'll presumably see. from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. 
Oh, you better get your eyes checked. That thing ain't glowing. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? Merlin's wait. beard. <laughs> Legacy, bro. Give me your heart. I Are you all right? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wiganweld potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Wiganweld. Kind of low key looks like nail polish, though. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Let's go, finally. I can't sprint yet. Man, look at these graphics, y'all. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Yo, 5,000 likes. Let's go. Thank you guys so much for the tapping the screen. Was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that poor key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. You mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent oh, years with searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. I like to explore a lot. I like to check out all the details, look for hidden stuff. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, that's the path down below. This way. Oh. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is 
is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Excellent. Use your camera to select an active target. Fair enough. Uh oh, this dude can slide, yo. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Oh. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We're close now, it's just ahead. It's getting windy. Steady yourself. Reparo. Beautiful. They valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. The mini map shows your surroundings with you in the middle. This is your current objective. Explore the ruins. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Mm. Perhaps mm. our host was a noted seer. Interesting. <laughs> Professor, this statue... This may have been his home. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. Like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Godric? 
Eric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Oh, someone's snoring. Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> uh, where are we here? <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? Hmm? The key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. What's up, Harley? Stay close. After you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. Oh. <laughs> How many volts are there? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. Yo. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It was the deepest wild. part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. You, you've already played it twice? Nice, dude. I'm glad to hear that. I'm super curious myself. Yo, Max, thanks for the follow, dude. Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Here we are. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Let's see what's up with that vault. Vault 12. 
Thank you for your help. Let's do it. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Ready your wand. Here we go. You can't hide. Revelio. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Revelio. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the pool key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. It's good, Not man. Out of Gringotts. Storyline's pretty good. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. towards the glow it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about are you all right yes sir i'm fine you seem to hey shelves how are you change. that statue what statue i see some sort of statue but only as a reflection in the floor Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected Revelio. in the floor. I'm doing good, Things, trying out this game. The reflection's still there. Curious to see how it was, so... Positions don't match. Playing something different. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. Tricky little guys, they turn it around and make you spin it around so you can mess up. 
You've acquired the Wand Lighting Charm Lumos, which has automatically been slotted to your spell set. Lumos creates a light at the tip of your wand to help you see in dark areas. Tap one to cast or extinguish Lumos. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. What's up, Justin? What's up, Knight? You love it? I'm glad that you're playing it too. That's awesome. Look out! Ah! Patego! Patego! Axio! Axio! Descendo! This is a uh, Hogwarts legacy. Professor, Professor Fig, Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Lumos. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. We're at 5.6 thousand likes. Let's try to shoot for 10,000. Tap the screen. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. What's up, Danny? How are you, Danny? Ah, oh, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Mm-hmm. Activating these statues here. Dustin, thanks for tapping the screen, dude. I see you. Let's go. I need to align these statues with their reflections. Let's get it. Thanks for cheering me on, buddy. Perhaps I need to get them all to stand at once. Lumos. There we go. Thanks, Jesse. So you gotta go to the center line right here. Oh, yo, what the heck? Stupid fire. Superfly. You got a potato. You're behind though. <laughs> Sweep the leg. <laughs> Wizards from the herd, you know? Stupid. 
super flat. Potato. Dang, how many of these guys are there gonna be? What the heck? Go. Nope. It's so beautiful. What is this? Justin, thanks for tapping the screen, dude. We're basin. at 6,000. Let's go. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Follow my lead. Amazing. All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Yo, did he just pull that out of his eyeball? That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam. And perhaps George died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. 
Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. <laughs> I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. Oh. I have no patience for traitors. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Kind of looks like the beam from Ghostbusters. Cinematic is awesome. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Awesome intro. sorting ceremony I'm no expert but that seems more appropriate there you go now I need to study this locket as soon as I can but first I must contact the ministry they need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock for the moment I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me of course sir thank you ready for the sorting ceremony
Oh man. yourself to meet the headmaster I don't know man that's a good question Fitch, have you played this game nice Gilbert to join us the sorting I'm just gonna do the classic over. one there were they're, they're also telling me to be the villain complications <laughs> maybe it like on a second playthrough I'll be a villain goblins I've no time for rumors fig and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left if you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Oh, you're like five hours in into it? Nice, dude. I, I'm glad Weasley, to hear that, man. We've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Either way, all the houses are awesome. Oh man, I'm getting nervous. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? Hey, take it easy. You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Hmm. I wonder. Mm, I detect something in you. A certain sense of. Mm, what is it? Ambition. Is it ambition? I may seem single minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Oh. Slytherin House, known for cunning, ambition, and a hunger for power. Slytherin. We'll do Slytherin. You belong in Slytherin. Nice. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley, 
pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Ah, uh, thank you. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're awesome. welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Just another beautiful day at Hogwarts. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. You gotta explore first. You always gotta explore. Let's go. What else? I suppose some introductions are in order. What's up, everybody? Already knew that. What's up, Sebastian? Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Appreciate Thank it. You. Appreciate Not it. Everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Thanks for the likes. Still impressive. Thanks for tapping the screen. Way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. It was nice meeting you, Sebastian. I'll let you get back to your book. Nice meeting you too. Good luck today. Nice, bro. Appreciate it, man. Trying to raid the stream already? What the heck? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Who knows what that's about, man? Don't say I didn't warn you. I just, I don't Check pay attention. It. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Mm. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. Yo, thanks for the follow. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the map. <laughs> Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. 
Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. All right. Making friends already. Oh, what's up, dude? Yo, this dude. What's up with this dude? Arms crossed. I, I think I heard one. Doubt mermaids hmm. find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> you're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. I'm away. Professor Weasley, eh? Revelio. Ah, there she is. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Oh. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's mm. expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Just disappears Thank under you, the armpit. Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. Yeah, what's up over here, though? I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Do keep up. I'm trying, I'm trying. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what details the field guide can provide? Revelio. The statue depicts the Kelpie, a shape-shifting water demon native to Ireland, Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long-maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported is a Loch Ness Monster in Scotland. 
Okay. You can just lock the field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Okay. This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges increase increases your level and power. Okay. Field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. Okay. Select your first guide page and lock the new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Okay. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards to unlock at each tier you complete from appearances to critical upgrades. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. Okay. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Will do. Yo. timing perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker your field guide contains a map of the castle open it up and find central hall All right, so this is to fast travel. That's pretty cool. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. I thought the Cat of Black would get rid of it. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes nice. today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. Yo, He's what's up, Death Knight? terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip What's up, up to the castle. What's up, Jace? I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost mm. precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Mm. Professor Fig. 
This is Hogwarts. Your ears must have been burning. Oh. Yes. What's up? What's up? L I J two thousand thirteen. You seem to have with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me. You have it? Nice. How do you like keep it? Keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade awesome. for those supplies. Glad you like it. All right. All right, guys. So I'm going to get some water real quick. I'll be right back. BRB. All right, got some water, got some candy, a little bit of nerd clusters. These are pretty dope. Let's do it. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left. What's my favorite us. house? Understood, Professor. Mm. Good. Now, as capable as you are, 
I believe the ability to possess obliges you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that you? I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Yeah, I like Gryffindor too. The classic. Let's take a look at the map. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be the required level or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest rewards. We can do the defense against the dark arts class or the charms class. With this one, you get a charmed compass. I get Levioso from this. And Axio. Let's see defense. Go ahead and track that quest. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your like hours may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Getting that XP. Hmm, so I gotta go upstairs. Revelio. What's up, what's up, what's up? What's up, dude? to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt, no? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity especially in the heat of battle now let's practice what we've just learned starting with something small steady your wand 
Okay. Got him. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Begin with a basic cost. Okay. See how the dummy deflected your cast. Mm -hmm. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember. So, now, well done. <laughs> to practice is by dueling we'll start with you two duelists take your marks time for a proper hogwarts welcome now <laughs> i want a fair duel using only levioso basic cast and protego you may begin levioso. this will be your first duel let's just say i'm a quick learner Things. I do just life Watch your opponent is trying to attack or defend yourself. Let's go. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. Yo, Parker, thanks for tapping the screen, yo. Appreciate it. And you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand yo, thanks for the follow. excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right, that's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Nice work. What's up, homie? I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Hmm. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Till next time. Cheerio.
I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. All right, now we gotta go to Charms class. Rebellion. Level two lock. Lumos. Rebellion. A field guide page. Nice, nice, nice. Lumos. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. All right, so we got to go get the charms done. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented food. And the boys don't make it any easier. The noise from their dormitory. Do you think I'm impressed? <laughs> I don't care how many chops it took. Please, please, Rebellion. Please. To the field guide page. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. What the heck? Flush the toilet. Yo, what's up, dude? Rebellion. Revelio, something <laughs> might not want to see. What's up, dude? You haven't seen my vids in so long. I'm glad you're watching the stream. So I gotta go upstairs. Revelio. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. I sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back. Yo, Behind thanks you. for the kind words, Fortnite Pro. I appreciate that. Here. Thank you. You always check if I'm live. Hello, Thank you. I am Netty. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Probably not, dude. Anyone? I'm gonna be putting some time into this game. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Mm. 
My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. All right, here we go. Oh. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! Pretty quick loading screen. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> mm -hmm. So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> um, uh, yeah. Hi -ya. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? <laughs> Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, Akio. think of this like gobs. Very good. Yeah. Happens to the best of us. Control there. That's it. Oh. Your composure. Very good. Points to Slytherin. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Come on up. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. Thirty points. All right. Akio. Let us see this. Oh, dang. That is how it's done. No, oh. not to worry. Thanks, bro. I appreciate that. Hitting me, dude. Almost had it. No, I'm just gonna be playing Let this game. Make this a bit more interesting. I'm enjoying this we? game so far. <laughs> I think 
we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go. Here we go. What games do I play? I like to play a little bit of everything. I like to play the Nintendo Action. Switch. Ah, man. Stay focused. Watch this. There we go. Yo, get out of the way, Professor. Can't see, bro. Trash. Let us see this. Yes. Not exactly your typical level. Not that I mind. Oh. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Like Xbox, nice. I'm playing on PC. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. <laughs> and with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course, you can use Akio on humans. A word, if you would. If you're so inclined. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Got that done. Wrecking that XP. Revelio. All right, so that's locked. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Yep, yep, yep. What's up? Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again.
again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. All right. What the heck? I should cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flat. Ooh, fight, fight. It's a bold attack. Revelio. The Minister of Flack. Levioso. Stop it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't get Peeves a flag. She says it's a boot, and he says it's a flag. Peeves, enough. You'll get us all detention. <sighs> and you're both wrong anyway. It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't Boots and it wasn't Black, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. How <laughs> nice to see you, my young friend. <laughs> Let's see. Let's take a look at the map now. Ad quests are now available. So those are the flags. All right, let's go try to get that side quest done. I think I'll go for a quick sprint on my broom. Ah. You know what? Let me do this main quest here. Required level two. Okay. Yeah. So I'm a level two so I can get that done. Can I fast travel? Let's see. Okay, I don't even think I need to fast travel, so. Oh, it's up with the smearer. Lumos. Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Hmm. Lumos Revelio
There you go. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you. Uh oh, what's up, Deke? Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. <laughs> ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from Australia. Mm. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first. What's up, Hunter? Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Hunter, thanks for sharing, buddy. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, I love pizza, your bro. friend will meet you at the castle. I had some pepperoni doors. pizza earlier no today. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butter beer at the a Three Brews. Butter beer? Yo, thanks for the follow. Rebellion. Uh -huh. Nice level three. On another adventure, are we? Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that the mending charm Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not nice. the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well. But first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I there have you go. arranged some for That's today. The move right there. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Rapero in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Let's get it. Revelio. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Hmm. 
Lumos. Revelio. Accio. Levioso. There we go. Yeah, there's supposed to be one here. Too. Going through my spells here. Incendio. What the heck? Why doesn't let me get it? Lumos. Levioso. Accio. There we go. A flying page must be around here somewhere. The preliminary time. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand oh boy, here is a conduit go. of your magic. Repairo. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It Davis. allegedly symbolized Harvelio. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed Repairo. out. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> All right, let's see what other quests we got. Yes, it is. What's up, Josh? This is Hogwarts.
Revelio. What are you up to now? Oops, wrong room. Okay, not too far. as it seems hello i don't believe we've met oh hello i'm lenora pardon me if i seem a little distracted at the moment everyone thinks i'm utterly balmy samantha thinks i'm potty but it's this painting i never noticed it before if i know hogwarts and i do an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason there's something more to this If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating Lumos. that solves the mystery. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. This looks like the location from the painting. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Accio! The moth stopped. Perhaps I need to keep casting Lumos on it. That makes sense. was a connection i should tell that's pretty cool that i solved the puzzle of that empty frame just ranking up xp yo lenora i solved the mystery of that painting you did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. But pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth! Alright, getting a little bit more hang of the game. Rebellion. Because I was doing a side quest. Oh dear! Another side I quest. Get in trouble. Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. That sounds brilliant, actually. 
Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around, so she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Why did Army tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. I suppose I could help, if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. All right. If I see side quests, I like to get them done. I like to get them out the way if I can. I'll build some XP Rebellion. too. Accio. Hmm. Nothing beats a leisurely evening flight. One boy fell off his broom for a night. Rebellion. Five bucks. I'm going to have to use Akio to get those books. One. Got it. Only four more to go. This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were her. Two more books. Bet you they're upstairs. One more. My mother thinks a foul foul. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Rebellion. What the heck? Let 
Lumos. Another moth. There it is. Bing. Level five, baby. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. What a relief! Thank you! I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Thank goodness some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Two out of three side quests. All right, let's go to the main quest now. It's a relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was empty. Emily. I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Nice. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a butterbee in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped Rebellion. up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective. Yeah, the scenery looks amazing. The one who elected that you take it. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas, but that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much. 
But it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Oh, wait, over here. I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. Rebellion. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Cool. The heck is that noise? Look, from the forbidden forest, hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Rebellion. Accio. <laughs> Absolutely. Like we already named them too. Prance hoop and sugarfoot. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah. There's Hogsmeade over the crest. Pass that ruin. Man, this is a long I would walk. I spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Mm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. I spend the entire day in Hogsmeade. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helps me to adjust quite a bit. Moonstone. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Rebellion. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jimmy, guys, ugly and airy and mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon. A Debbie, guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. <laughs> I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade.
Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spell crafts, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Awesome. Reminds me of Universal Studios. I remember uh, I wanted to try to get a butter beer and the lines were ridiculous to try to get that. All right, so a lot of quests here. Let me track one of them. An honest day's work. Revelio. be right with ah it's you um just a moment please uh, mm. hello sir i'm looking for for a new wand yes it's about time yes uh, about time well you're our new fifth year student are you not oh what am i saying of course you are gerbold olivander's the name but of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Mm, powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Mm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. <laughs> hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Fireworks. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Oh, 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 oh goodness. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. <laughs> uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Finalize wand. There's different types, variations. How intriguing. Light brown, dusty pink. I'm going to do warm brown for sure. Gray, soft spiral. Ash brown, dark, ringed, crooked spiral. How intriguing! I think this one looks more like a wand to me. 
Wood type Hawthorne. Curious indeed. Fairy cedar. Sue Cypress and bent flexibility and bend lean, slightly yielding, squishy, bendy. That Curious one's fine. Oh, there's so many types, that's crazy. Powerful magic. Every unicorn serves as the core of a wand known for producing consistent magic. Powerful. A range of magic. Hmm. Dragon heartstring one do dragon heart string. powerful. Baby, and thanks for the follow. Quickly. How intriguing. I'm going to go for consistent. I'm going to go for the consistency. What do you think? Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Indeed. Treat it well. And you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Nice. Rebellion. I wouldn't mind a job in that alchemy center. Yo, thank you so much for the gifts. Thank you so much. Visit tomes and scrolls. Let's see. Yo, Ty, thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow, Ty. Magic Neep. Okay, Tums and Scrolls. Day Pippin's Potions. Okay, so this one's right here. Set a waypoint there, make it easy. Standing 
Rebellion. Dope. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Of course it is not without complexity. But that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course. And you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, seeing it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Potting table with a small pot spellcraft. Unlocks the ability to conjure a potting table with a small pot. Use its pot to grow all sorts of useful magical plants. I'm going to do the potion station or I can buy both of them actually. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my infantry. Back here, I didn't know you can come back here. Revelio. Accio. Levioso. Lumos. Repairer. Hmm. Okay, I think I, I just revealed these stairs. Let me see what's up here. Revelio. Accio. Nice. Okay, let me set a waypoint to the next place to make it easier. So I need to go to those to that potion place. I hope schools treat you well. If anyone ever knew Welcome Rebellion. to the potions. Awesome. We got all the pages for Hogsmeade. Let's go. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, 
I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this Parry is Pippin. J. Pippin's Potions. J. Potions for Pippin's all ailments. Potions. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Yo. A potion's free. What's up, Ryan? Fast. Long time no see, it buddy. It may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Ooh. Healing potion. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Nope. Oh. Man, I could be grinding for XP all day long, bro. What's the next one? Magic Neep. Let's get it. What up, Nemo? Revenge. I love it, bro. Dude, it's refreshing, man. I can grind this XP all day long, bro. What's up, Timmy? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. What's up, Caleb? Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neat. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Yo, Mr. Go Sports, thanks yourself. for tapping the screen, dude. Appreciate it. Let's try to get to 10,000, yo. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a package of Dittany seeds? Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. What's up, Caleb? I'll take the free stuff, dude. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Maybe next time, homie. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Natty. Look at that paper Rebellion. right there. You're in my Fortnite stream? Nice, dude. Thanks for being there, man. Level 5 already, bro. Crazy. Alright. So I gotta meet Natty at the town castle. Let's do it. Thanks for watching my videos, man. I appreciate it. Uh, dude, I've been on for two and a half hours, bro. <laughs> like when it's when there are games like this, dude. I I can stream all night, bro. It is fun, dude. I I could probably play this all day. 
I like to grind stuff like that. Yo, what up, Blue? What the heck? Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. It's like an ogre. <laughs> What's up, homie? Get me out of there, bro. What was that? I was trying to beat him in his own game. I like it too much. What's this? You gotta parry, get out of there. Oof. What is this? This is Hogwarts, bro. With the punches, everything I'm getting it. It's been pretty Goodness. good so far. This is my first a time playing it. Troll. It's Did been pretty good, man. Take on a fully grown troll by yourselves. I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely refreshing, aura, dude. If you ask me, if you are unharmed. Perhaps the two of you would play mind helping game. me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. <laughs> That's fine, bro. And thank you, again. Yeah. 
What is this? Repair the oh, Rebellion. my bad, dude. Repairo. Repairo. Okay, they didn't do more damage. So I got a repair. Repair. In that XP. Repair. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Repairo. That'll be fifty eight dollars. We were just talking about you. Bro, say some. Revelio. A little bit of tea. Revelio. Yo, why won't this dude talk, man? Lumos. Dude, say Never something. Lose. Let me try going in and out. Let me see if that fixes it. Hello, sir. There I don't go. believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Uh, Augustus Hill. Clothia extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. 
I own glad rags, wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. All right, so this one's free 99. Time to equip. Cloaks and robes. Okay, got that equipped. an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the Just three one? <laughs> Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. I sell even more battle-worthy items. Revelio, you're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Let me open. <laughs> Repairer. Hmm. All right, time to go to the three broomsticks. Rebellion. There you go. Level six, baby. What's this over here? Man, I love exploring games like this. Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. The three broomsticks. Uh oh. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student <laughs> take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is. That if you cannot get to the child, then you I bet have you that no dude's got like really bad breath. Me. <sighs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Quickly now, quickly. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. 
I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with. Are... Oh. oh, time lane. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Hmm. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, I got that thing on my me. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the Ovenus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Hmm. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. Yo, what's up, Kate? Kieran. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Rebellion. Something upstairs, maybe. Chest over here, sorcerer hat. Okay, Rebellion. Just curious what's inside this door. Okay, so this leads outside. Gotcha, gotcha. I'm gonna keep exploring. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. Yo, take care, Caleb. Thanks for stopping by, bro. Return to the common room. Okay, so I gotta go back to Hogwarts and fast travel to my room. Where's my room at though? Let's see. The bell tower maybe? No. I 
There we go. Back in my room. We completed two out of four main quests. Got some XP, 260 XP, nice. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for me. Awesome gameplay so far. Really liking the story, loving the XP grind. And I'll be back on tomorrow. I'll play some more and we'll continue to finish the game. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Peace.